Hi, I wanted to show you our app that we made to push contacts uh, in Procore to inactive projects from your company directory. And let's go ahead and get started. Uh, like I mentioned in the email, this is pretty rudimentary. So <clears throat> if you see anything, they're like, oh, that's kind of quirky. It is um, <laughs> at this stage. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, let's run it. And it's going to ask me to go to Procore, log in. It produces this uh, authorization code. Copy that come back over here, um, I punch it in here, I hit next, and then it's gonna want me to pick a company. We're gonna pick this one, and I'm gonna pick uh, these three archived projects as an example. I'm gonna pick uh, someone that's not real. Let's see if we can't find someone that looks like a good, oh, Jerry Seinfeld, there we go. And then let's pick a project manager template for him and hit next. And that looks like that's about it. So let's come over here to DJ's portfolio. Here's archived project one. You can see it's inactive. And let's go down here to the directory. Project one, Jerry Seinfeld, project manager. Okay, archived project two, directory. Jerry Seinfeld, project manager. And then directory again. And then Jerry Seinfeld. Project Manager. So right now it only pushes contacts that are inactive. Uh, that's just a switch that we can change so it brings in all of your uh, company directories, contacts, active, um, oh, sorry, <laughs> misspoke company projects, active or inactive. Right now it's only showing the inactive projects. And so we can switch that over as well as you saw, it only let me pick one user to assign them. We can change that so you can assign multiple people um, to, to multiple projects. So let me know if this is something you're interested in and we'll um, see what we can do. Talk to you soon. Bye.